on um, Formula One. going on here I did that. So our car's not actually up that top, far up. Yeah, we're like second to last. And we've got an issue we'd like your input on. Thanks. I know these kinds of decisions can be challenging, but I think you made the right call. As we continue to increase our acclaim, more potential partners become willing to work with us. We can now approach an additional sponsor from the corporate tab. Oh yeah, we can. So we're just doing our car.
we gotta change our team colors. And we're going to do, we got the Austrian Grand Prix guys. We had a major issue on the production line earlier this week, so the entire development package for this weekend has failed. Any redevelopments will need to be ordered from the R&D screen. So let's get, we're going with Austria, that ain't that bad hopefully. I can't remember what track this is. So we're just going to skip to Q. Yeah, we'll skip to practice free from now. Get our full around the track. Because I've not been on this track for a little while now. So yes. This is Don't push the car just yet. Track is still green. Try and take it easy for the first couple of laps. Okay. This track, never mind. I think the game's a bit too loud. So, how's everyone's day going? I don't know when I'm, I'm going to post this. So yeah. And also we probably are going to do better than our teammate. Like normal. Because our teammate is trash. That's why I like a new driver. That's why I think that's what that watch thing means. Because I don't really want to have him on my team no more. 
We'd rather have like Pereira Gasly. Pereira Gasly. So we're gonna go for our first like practice lap quickly. <coughs> Yeah, I think I like this track. I think I'm going to be good at it. I feel like one shot qualifying is going to mess me up a little bit though. I feel like it's going to make us start further back in the grid, but... Yeah, well, we should be fine, hopefully. Because our car's not actually fully there yet. It's going to take a little while to fully upgrade this car. I actually don't know my rival. Rival status. Let's focus on the race right now. Okay, we don't we'll have a rival. That later. So that's good. And now we can just go eat. we back into our garage. Yeah, and I don't with all the cars now over the line, let's see our top three again. And where did our Joker, Verstappen and Valtteri Bottas. Sadly, 21st. it's time to say goodbye as free practice is over. However, we'll be back shortly. So, yeah. Yeah, but he's not good. I, I can't wait to do that, like, because once he's, like, gone, we've got, like, we can like, get a better teammate, hopefully. Fingers crossed we can, anyway. Yep, let's just get this on the road again. On the road again. Mechanics, please stand clear. We're ready to go. Uh, hopefully, yeah, we get like a faster slap because I don't really want to be stuck in like P1, like P4. So everyone's already leaving their garage. Which is good but not good because then you're just going more cars out. And the tracks are very busy. Oh my god, my DRS is broken, I think. Okay, now like the truck's getting very busy.
We could just like return to garage and qualify and see what happens. I mean, yeah. We're all ready for tomorrow's race, but see. before we begin, let's have a quick look at those who will be fronting the grid. Joker. See, I think it's going to be this. Too, I think it's not this race is going to be like rainy too. This isn't really good for me. Like, ne it's never going to be good. Like a whole season we got with brand new Joe. Hopefully he can improve dr like during things. Welcome to the beautiful Styrian Mountains for another chapter in the story of the Austrian Grand Prix. The Spielberg circuit then is situated 700 meters above sea level, with just 10 corners making up one of the shortest laps of the season. One time around here is a distance of 2.6 miles, with the best overtaking chances into turn one or the tight uphill turn three. And with me as usual is Anthony Davidson. Let's talk briefly about Lando Norris. That was a great win in the last race. Can they keep that momentum going this weekend? It's always nice to come into a Grand Prix weekend on a high, but your expectations are based much more on your practice and qualifying runs. So it's the momentum from those sessions that they'll be hoping to carry into the race today. Off the back of a fantastic qualifying session, it's time to see how our starting grid looks for today's race. Joker lines up on pole position and Lewis Hamilton completes the front row. Considering the rest of the grid, we have Verstappen, Bottas, Charles Leclerc and Norris, Sainz, Ricardo, Fernando Alonso and Pierre Gasly, Ocon, Sonoda, George Russell and Perez. Giovinazzi, Raikkonen, Lance Stroll, and Nicholas Latifi. Mick Schumacher, Joe. Mazepin and Sebastian Vettel starts from the back of the grid. That's it then, it's time to go racing as we head to trackside for today's race. All right, we're gonna get this race underway. So we're probably gonna go for a two stop. No, I can't change to mediums. So yeah, we'll go to... Oh, well. Yeah. Right, let's do this. Okay, we're monitoring somewhere on the ICE. Be aware that we will start to see a loss of power. Oh dear. Not good for like the second or third race, can't remember. And we did do, we did great now. Let's keep going. So let's just get away from the grid, like the pack. Let's just hopefully we'll win. Hopefully we will win. It'll be a nice to win a race after last like, last video. If you don't remember what happened is um, that I got a grid penalty for cutting corners. I think if it was it was five five seconds, and we got put in second or third. So yeah, I wasn't happy about that race. That was very annoying. But hopefully this race we can recover from it. But we already are like pulling away from um, the back of the grid. Don't know why I make my like pit window up like, ten to seventeen. That won't good. Teammate status. Gap 
that a teammate behind is 12.2 seconds. They're on fresh softs. They're in 20 second. The time last oh my. was a That's how bad he is. Championship standings. As things stand, we'll be leading the championship. Thank you. At least then we will be leading it. So yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, once this season doesn't, we'll leave Grand New Joe behind. I don't believe. I don't. I don't know why I signed him. Bad idea. But it's okay. The six can be fixed. <laughs> Hopefully. So yes. Yeah, so did Lewis. So Lewis and that did get a good start, and then Max Verstappen got a good start, and then I didn't actually good, get good as a good start as them lot. But then I overtook Hamilton and Bottas and that. Just yeah, over oh, just ahead time. of him. Rain in ten minutes. Oh great. No, I knew I was recording. Don't like me. I hope that's not true. Okay, how am I not getting caught for cut corner cutting? That's weird. There we go, first one in. Let's just hopefully we hope hope for the best, yeah? <coughs> that we win this race. Well, I did, we're getting pulling far ahead now. Well, my teammate's actually like 21st. Not good. At all. Weather report. We're expecting rain in around 10 to 15 minutes. Dry seem like the fastest tyre at the moment. Wait, why am I to Hamilton? Yeah, 
who keeps getting overtaken. I feel like I don't know who's last. I feel like it's near Kit and Mazepin. Oh. I wonder what happened to him. We're approaching the pit window. You'll be on the hearts. I know I'm to Gasly. No, I could probably check during the race, but that's just like I could bet Roger, but I'm just waiting. We're leading our teammate by 34.6 seconds. Of course we would be, because he's like last. See, we know the car can do it. It's doing good because it's like fast and somehow Red Bull. Somehow. And it's also faster than Mercedes somehow. So, yeah, he should be up here, but he's probably driving very terrible, probably. I need you to stop cutting the corners. If you keep it up, the stewards will award you a penalty. Jeff Nanya. Oh, they're pitting early. Not changing like a matter of no sex. One you is coming in for a stop. Expect to see some rain about 10 to 15 minutes from now.
Hi. Release, release. Release, release. Look after these tires now. We want to finish the race on this compound. No, we don't. Actually, no, maybe we do. Gap behind is twenty point seven seconds. So that does mean the cart does good. Well, it is doing good. The Guan Yu Joe cannot show that. Like, really, man, it's, we're going slow. So we're at the third or second race, and we're like winning it. Could that mean our car's better than Mercedes somehow? But I don't know how it would show that, but then... <coughs> if we're going faster than Mercedes, and also Red Bull and McLaren and Ferrari, that means our car is at the top of the spot there. Weather report. Looks like rain is inbound, and we're expecting it in around five minutes. Five minutes till the rain dries seem like the best tyre for now. Full race update. Say again, you're breaking up. Full race update. You're leading the pack. P1, Verstappen behind. D gap to the car behind is 21.7 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. That was our last stop. No more scheduled pit stops. Six laps to go. the fastest lap of the race. Keep this up. Teammate status. They're on fresh mediums. They're in 18th. The time last lap was a 1.13.2. Five laps of fuel remaining. Cool. Weather report. Rain is imminent. Rain is imminent. Be careful out there. Dry seem like the well, fastest time. I can't see moment. no rain. Oh dear. The will give you a penalty. We've been awarded a time penalty. It will go against our finishing time at the end of the race. So first.
tire status. No issues with tire wear for now. Keep taking care of them. Weather report. Watch the conditions. We think there's rain coming pretty soon. Dries seem like the best tire for now. Make your mind up, man. Three laps of fuel remaining. Okay, here's the rain. Weather report. This rain could be with us for a while. Light rain conditions for the foreseeable future. Dry seem like the fastest tire at the moment. Just drifted my car. Hello. Charger is on its last legs. Let's try to keep mileage on it to a minimum. Are you serious? Like everything in my car's breaking. Weather report. We'll be seeing at least 20 minutes of light rain. Dries seem like the best tire for now. This is your final lap, final lap of the race. Weather report. This is your final lap, final lap of the race. The forecast suggests this rain is going to keep getting stronger for at least the next 15 minutes. Dry seem like the fastest tire at the moment. There we go, what a rascal race. Absolutely fantastic. It's a brilliant result, well done. Somehow. I think Sergio deserves it. Smiling faces on the pit wall after a superb win here in Spielberg, and rightly so, a brilliant effort from the whole team. Talk to me, Ants, what was it that set them apart from the competition today? I really feel the track layout, combined with the track temperatures we saw today, suited their car. 
These cars come alive when the tires are just at the right temperature, and the driver did a great job managing that as well. They just look so comfortable out there. It's like anything, it always looks so easy when it all just clicks. Well, I'm thoroughly exhausted after the excitement of that race, but I'm sure it's nothing compared to our drivers here. They've worked hard to make it up there, and it's great to see them make their way out onto the podium. So, what's next we see? Do, Let's do see this. how the driver standings have changed. Joker takes over the lead at the Drivers' Championship. Some amazing talent out on the track today. But Anthony, who would you pick as your driver of the day? Well, there's a lot of incredible driving out there today, Crofty. But if I had to pick someone, it's got to be Sergio Perez. Fantastic driving. Let's move on to the constructors. McLaren continue to increase their gap at the top. There was also a strong showing from the Mercedes team today as they make their way up the standings. It's been an absolutely wild weekend of Formula One action. I can't wait to see what's next. I think Grand New Joe should be pushing, pushing the car. That no, I am because. Amazing performance oh. out there. Hello. I'm sure you're pretty happy with that. Who's your main competition on the grid? See, these are people like far down the grid. You're leading the championship. Are you happy to be there or feeling the pressure? Well, looks like your luck has changed. Things went a lot better than last weekend, didn't they? Your team must be ecstatic with how you're performing. Great. Well, that's everything. <sighs> also, my team. Yeah, my team. Yeah, my team must be. Because I am the team manager. Like, yeah. So, we're going to do all our upgrades this, like, video. Well, try to. See, I've made more money than him as well because he done nothing, not well, practically nothing. Yeah. So yeah, we're halfway through the season because I didn't know how, what, how to perform this car properly if it was going to perform good, but it does perform good. I hope it <coughs> will be for the next few races. So then we do vehicle. The personnel team wants to run this one past you. Thanks for stepping in and helping handle that. So we're just going to do like general wear stuff quickly. Oh, it's a home grid GP guys. Okay. So yeah. We've had the new parts come through the fabrication process. We'll have them with us for the next Grand Prix. See, like, his expectations is just rubbish. We could try getting George Russell. How about Kim? Oh, Mick. You know what? Yeah, we're gonna get Mick.
So yeah. And that's going to end this video for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next video.